Hi everyone, this is Ray with the channel Love Water Healing and I'm here to do a reading for all of my cancers for the month of uh, August. Yes, we are here already, August. Keeps like floating past my brain for some reason when I'm doing these readings. I guess I'm just not ready for it, but I'm here. So I guess I am ready for it. <laughs> okay, we're we'll using the Flower of Life cards, the Sacred Circle Oracle cards, and the Wandering Star Tarot cards. Let's see first what Flower of Life card you have this month. Okay, Cancer, what do you have? Make sure to check out your Sun, Moon, and Rising to get a full picture of what this month has in store. And you have Lightworker. And it says, you are a light worker. You're here to inspire and to enlighten yourself and others to move from fear into love. This will be present always in all that you do. You don't have to figure out how you're going to do it, for you have always been doing it. As you allow light to illuminate your inner world, embrace and love all parts of you. You feel yourself shift from fear into love. Today, let us give great thanks to Mother Earth for the incredible privilege of being here. Through co-creation, we anchor our streams of consciousness into her for the joy of creating, expanding, and lightworking. This brings love and growth for all, you and I, Mother Earth, the solar system, galaxies, the universe, and beyond. You are spinning light into the web of life. Okay, there you go, Cancer. I mean, just be out there for everyone to see. Okay, let's see what Wandering Star Tarot cards have in store for you um, as you're going through in this co-creative, uh, conscious, amazing experience. Let's see what the rest of August has to say. So that's your overall theme there, Cancer. So I would say that um, illuminate not only the world around you, but your inner world for this month. Okay, let's see what we got ourselves. Eee. Car just wants to go flying. Okay. Okay, so um, Ten of Pentacles is really prosperous and abundant for you this month, Cancer. So there could be an inheritance. Um, there's some kind of something maybe about property that's coming through. Um, this could also be about family. Um, a spouse, for example. So it'll it looks like it's fine. You got the two of wands. Um, so this is plans for the future. Um, the two of wands. It also is about partnerships. So family, and then we get to partnerships. Like I said, my could be spouse. Um, you know, two people doing something and having fun. Um, then you have the Ace of Cups. So this also talks about love and relationships. So it is about a spouse um, or someone, a significant other in your life. Um, and this is possibly someone new that's coming in. There's a new beginning that you're looking for. Maybe there's a renewal of a current relationship. But it's all good. Uh, and then you have the Nine of Wands. So this is about um, creating a boundary and having strength in a situation. So maybe something comes up for you mid-August um, that feels like you need to uh, take a step back. Um, you're going to come across a helpful person. So this is the King of Pentacles. And um, he is going to bestow upon you um, you know, a generous vision, let's say that. Uh, then you have the Six of Pentacles. So again, this is receiving family. This could be about um, someone having a pregnancy. Um, this is just giving and receiving. So it looks like this month is just going to be really, really good for you. Uh, make sure that you just maintain a positive attitude and um, everything is going to be really good. Okay, let's see what sacred circle oracle card you have for the month. You have the turkey. Turkey is giveaway and sharing. So maybe in this uh, prosperous moment, you have a sharing experience where you start to share with um, other people around you. Or maybe you're finally, um, you know, sharing with yourself and you're doing for yourself in this prosperous moment. So it says, the stone number is eight. And it says, blessings to give away and sharing. Mine is the spirit of giving and sharing. Give your love, share your heart. Share 
yourself with others so they may know the joy within you. Make way for a better things to come in. Become one with all and let all become one with you, then watch your joy increase exponentially. So maybe this is the way that you're going to get into this month of August um, for all the prosperity that's coming uh, ahead. The tree is the coast uh, live oak. Blessings for nurturing and balance. And the crystal is azure light and the blessings for re um, to release barriers. So turkey counsels in the art of giving and sharing. It demonstrates self-sacrificing for the higher good, spiritual balance and strength. Turkey shares how Mother Earth gives all the hidden wisdom within you and how to give unselfishly without thinking. When that learning occurs, we get what is needed to improve ourselves. In giving unselfishly without expecting anything in return, we learn the process of Mother Nature. So the turkey also is giving, you know, um, bringing you back out into mother nature as well so maybe in this giving and sharing you're going to come across something that you're going to feel really abundant and prosperous with and you're going to feel like sharing it with all the different people that are in your life and there you go cancer that's what i've got for you uh, make sure that you hit that like button and you subscribe down below and if you need a reading make sure you visit my website which is listed down below i appreciate you being here thank you so much have a fantastic, wonderful month. And as always, love your water and love yourself. And I'll see you on the next video. I love you.